So one of the main challenges with accounts receivables is the huge amount of transactions that customers have to deal with, with especially in the B2B space when you talk about hundreds and thousands of customers, you have millions of invoices and you really have to go after every transaction. So that's where a lot of time is being spent by having AR teams manually going after invoices, trying to get paid, trying to apply the payment or trying to figure out why the customer has not paid on something. So that's a main challenge of being very transaction heavy in the B2B space. So when you have this challenge of a lot of transactions that you have to manually go after, that's when you look into technology, where technology come to save you, right? So you look at robotics, where you can automate manual repetitive tasks so that you can get rid of all those tasks, transactions that you really don't have to have a person manually spending time because there's no real decision that the person is doing there. So you really focus on trying to automate those tasks using robotics and you use artificial intelligence, which is nothing but machine learning algorithms to identify patterns, to look at patterns from a customer standpoint or from all the transaction standpoint and really use that information to tailor the behavioral change that you want to bring in your customers. Maybe change the way you collect with the customer or maybe change the credit terms that you're extending to the customers or maybe change the amount of manpower that you assign to a certain segment of customers. So Hyred has worked with uh, big name brands like Nike, Adidas, Johnson & Johnson, Walmart, Procter & Gamble. So a common theme across all these customers is it's not just their huge scale, but also the fact that they have such huge amount of transactions going across currencies, across regions, different types of customers. So you do not have a one-size-fit-all solution, doesn't matter if it's for collections, disputes, credit, or cash application. You really have to identify using technology, using machine learning algorithms for every customer, identify what are the various payment patterns they have, what are, what are the various deductions behaviors that they have in the past. So that's, that's where we really focus on from a high radius standpoint, trying to help these customers tailor their solutions to the problem that they have in each of their space. But the common theme being, use robotics to automate the repetitive task and use machine learning algorithms to help decision making for your analysts. So when we are talking about looking at adopting technology, from a treasury standpoint, their primary focus is to bring in cash flows, right? So when we talk about accounts receivables, in, in one way it's more of a cost center. But it's really important to identify the impact that improving the efficiencies and improving technology in space of collections, disputes, credit, accounts receivables as a whole brings to Treasury in the form of improved cash flows. It's just because of the sheer volume of these organizations, the sheer magnitude of the size. Even if they're bringing in a change of one day of DSO improvement, it's amazingly uh, huge in terms of dollar values for these companies. So from a treasury standpoint, looking at the end product not just as efficiency and not just as a technology adoption, but the impact on cash flow that it could have.